Well, looks like I got another issue. Not long after getting my HVAC system installed, you know, my hot water heater. I've had this thing, well, I bought the house in 1996, and I had, this is one of the first modifications I had done to eliminate an electric 20-gallon hot water tank to get a 40-gallon natural gas tank. And so this thing is probably 22, 23 years old. Um, maybe the nameplate has a date code on it, made by State Industry. 1996 so yeah we're looking at 24 yeah 24 years so this is 2020 um, wow yep and there's my issue I've got water in the drip pan so the pilot light went out I noticed that this morning my hot water wasn't as hot as it normally was but it was enough to take a shower with but now Take a shower when I get home from work. No, it's like cool. Not quite cold, but it's cool. So, and I got all sorts of water. This this tank is full. Luckily, I got a drain right there, and it's up to the level where it's actually draining out. So it looks like this thing may have failed. Tried to light the pilot light, and it won't light. So it tells me this thing has probably failed. So I called my buddy that installed my HVAC system and he says he can install a water heater but he won't get out here till Sunday morning which it's Saturday evening right now to get out here and you know probably uh, help me replace it so I'll go with his um, guidance to find out you know what would be a good brand to go with I mean this one's lasted a long time you know state water here this is from the gas company um, way back then they were offering rebates where you could buy the hot water heater through them and you just pay it off on your monthly bill so I didn't have to pay anything but obviously that's way back in the past and they don't do this anymore so now yep I'm gonna have to probably replace this thing and it's got a drain here I guess for draining the water out and then they have to run a hose from up here in the attic to down below and drain the uh, water out of it so it can be you know moved so yeah well, that's awesome but I guess it was a matter of time and I've been kind of looking at maybe getting something that's uh, more modern I was thinking of one of those tankless styles but I think they run off a 220 volt AC and I don't have that up here maybe it's worth possibly getting I don't know I'll talk to uh, my buddy Mark that runs the HVAC you know central heat and air company so get his recommendation either going with another tank like this or maybe possibly going with a tankless setup I don't know so we'll just see when he comes out here in the morning see what he can do and what he recommends all right well just picked up a new 40 gallon hot water heater from Home Depot. I didn't take my camera with me because I went with the contractor to pick it out and decide which one we were going to get. Got accessories that we'll need for installation. But uh, yeah, basically, this is an emergency Sunday repair because with the virus going around and all that crap, this I definitely need to have hot water in my house. So, yeah, they're going to. Uh, get I guess their work clothes and they'll be back here in a bit we'll record the removal of my 24 year old gas water heater and installation of this new one <laughs> I'm going to go to the next one. 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 I
all right well looks like the battery died on me i'm not sure how much i got but we got a new water heater it's even got a little pulsating status I'll let you know it's working but yeah total price this came to like 4.69 uh, I think it was on sale 419 and we got some extra parts that we needed to get it installed and uh, new drip pan so I knew the other one once we tried to get it out you know that was just a pain that thing was still full of water we had to get it tilted on its side to finish draining the water out and it was pretty rusty coming out of there so yeah it looks like it had definitely failed from age but uh, yep we got a ream with a six-year warranty apparently that's what comes with this model 36,000 BTU um, and then of course Home Depot has another five-year extended warranty on top of that now I've heard you know pros and cons about their war warranty and them honoring it and this that and the other so hopefully it never comes to that because the last one you know like I said lasted 24 years so hopefully this one will last close to that length of time so but yeah we got hot water heater or hot water again so we can fight this virus and you know i got it set to c which is you know the, there's a b c and d so c is close to very hot you know so we'll just go with that but yep yeah, i'll go ahead and load up the uh, old one and i'll probably drop it off to my buddy's tommy my buddy tommy's house he's gonna use it for scrap so yeah, but this is pretty much wrapped up. Well, that's not bad. 24 years. Hope the other one lasts as long. So, yeah. So there you go. 1996. All right, well, this project is done. Until next time, adios.